job centre, yes, I'll hold. <laughs> he, I mean, no one kind of like likes to <laughs> I appreciate I have the face of someone who takes drugs, but I can assure you I don't. <laughs> I don't know why. I mean, like, I walk down the street and the local spare some change guy just starts herring after me. Scoot, 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 do you want some sand? I think I'm fine going to Sainsbury. Cheers, mate. You're right. You know, and unfortunately, I don't just have one of those faces that, you know, kind of like, I take drugs. I don't know whether it's meth or warning or I know where the good stuff is. But, like, <laughs> I also have that, how can I help you? Like, if you're a big sister, anyone have siblings here? Yeah. yeah. Wicked, yeah. The enthusiasm, I can hear it. Brother. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. And, um, like, if you're a sibling, like, even, like, my best friend, it's actually her birthday today. Hello. Virgos unite. Uh, <laughs> it, like, we actually met, because we were in the club, in the four times, and, like, from out of nowhere, I just said, and then his head on my shoulder's like, oh, you're right, mate. Oh, there, there, come on. Oh, it's okay. Let it all out. It's all right. There's no judgment here, darling. It's okay. It's okay. And, like, I just, yeah. And, I mean, looking back on the, these past two years, trying to explain to people out of London how desperate the situation got, like, complete strangers were talking to each other in the supermarket. <laughs> I could hear my neighbour every day, kind of like the Amazon driver, kind of like, no, I'm fine, yes, I get paid a wage, just take your packet and go. I'm not in the mood for this. But yeah, and um, like, no matter what you do, I'm very conscious of like, what you do. Hello guys, hello, hello. Yes, I used to work in retail. Like, and it's a, it's a curse having a, can I help you face when you're doing one of the grisliest jobs ever. It's just kind of like, because retail is not the easiest gig. And it's just kind of like, yeah, do you work here? It's like, no, I like drinking cold tea behind the counter. How can I help? <laughs> and, you know, it's just kind of like, guys come up to you. It's like, yeah, I've got to get something for my girlfriend. And you're huh? And they'll look directly there. Like, She's about your size. Oh, wicked sexual harassment. In the <laughs> so, as long as I'm in the same, it's absolutely fine. And, like, do a stand-up comedy. No one prepares you. No, I really can't do that bit. No one prepares you for the absolute weirdness of being a comic. You've got to resign yourself to the fact that from now on, as soon as you switch on your phone, first thing in the afternoon, your phone is just bing, 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 and you've got to accept Facebook friend requests from guys with profile pictures holding the mic like this. <laughs> <laughs> and for a female, can kind of like, I'm a 90s singer. I'm really being Or I know, it's like, I'm a comic, but I'm not smiling. <laughs> I know. But um, yes, um, should I tell that story? But yes, uh, it's kind of spooky being here, and it's also really special, because Backyard, I love you guys. We survived the, we're, well, the pandemic isn't over, but we're kind of like, not wearing jumpsuits anymore, are we? <laughs> yes, it's lovely. Um, and it's kind of weird because I don't think my family know, but my uncle, he gave me a look. He did. Yeah, he didn't storm off, honestly. <laughs> but he just gave me a really filthy look that only a Greek man can give you. And it's like, there are professional beggars. It's like, he's rumbled my Patreon. <laughs> Better put the only fans under a different name. <laughs> Just someone who looks like me. No, really? She had tattoos as well. That's a surprise. <laughs> no idea. But um, like, I think we've all done things that we're not really proud of. Ah, the cop is gone. No, I'm still not going to do that bit. <laughs> we've all done things we're not proud of during the pandemic. You know, whatever gets you through the night. Brothers and sisters and enemies. So all the friends and ultras. Um, you know, and I wanted to encourage my friends by sharing quotes, you know, kind of like, in matters of the heart and loins, we are all idiots, boy George. <laughs> and I didn't want to be that person, you know, if you can't handle me at my worst, you don't deserve me at my best, big red flag. <laughs> you know, like, no one ever wants to be that person. And you know, if Carrie Bradshaw had Instagram, that would be the first thing she'd post. <laughs> and maybe the sign of maturity and growing up is when you look at Carrie Bradshaw and it's just like, Jesus, you're a massive pain in the arse. <laughs> I 
having a friend like you is like, so he's kind of like back again and it's like, and they don't know where I stand and you dump him. <laughs> don't need this shit. But there's only one more thing to say and it's just really important and I hope like you really feel me on this one because it's like happy birthday to you. Happy birthday.